A lot of people consider their hairstylist a therapist of sorts. Sometimes their, their friends, their husbands, their partners don't even know what they're struggling with. In 2020, Hampstead salon owner Kendra Runnels says there was one conversation that started coming up more frequently. We really started to notice um, hair loss. Runnels didn't know it then, but as we started to learn more about the impact of COVID-19, it became clear that the stress of the virus can cause hair loss. This can occur with any type of stress on the body. Um, it is more common um, with more severe illnesses, especially illnesses that do include fever. In fact, Dr. Brendan Murphy says nearly 30% of patients who suffer severe COVID symptoms will experience hair loss within a few months. And then I started seeing bald patches. That's exactly what happened to Michelle Bowendoni of Salem. You know, a lot of like what you, what you look like, how you feel your self-esteem, like you know what you look like in the mirror, and your hair is a big part of that. For Michelle and so many others, the emotional distress was overwhelming. See, all my friends and family never heard of this, so I've been following Kendra on uh, Instagram. Runnels has owned Parlor Beauty since 2015. In 2020, amid the pandemic, when other businesses were closing, she opened the Wig Parlor, an intimate boutique that specializes in hair loss. It's unfortunate what I see, but I'm grateful for being busy and I'm grateful for the opportunity to help people. Runnels has solutions for all levels of hair loss, from hair regrowth products to full wigs and everything in between. These are 100% human hair. But she says one of the most important pieces of someone's hair loss journey is support. How does that feel in your head? I think it's always nice to know that, you know, I'm going to be okay. You know, I have options and that this is temporary. And now Bowen Doni is joining Runnels on the same mission, letting others know they're not alone. I'm glad to be able to bring light to a subject that's such a stigma. In Hampstead. It matches perfect. Yeah, this is perfect. Catherine Underwood, WMUR News 9.